Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. My name is Rose and I'm here to bring you another weekly love tarot reading. These are for entertainment purposes only, so just take the parts that speak for you and leave the rest. And if you require a personal reading, all the details on how to work with me and connect with me will be in the show more section below. Uh, these six cards will form the main part of the read, Aries, but before we dive on in and unpack those cards together, I thought it would be a good idea to kick off this read using an archetype oracle card, just to get an overall feel and energy of what's coming through in love and relationships uh, with whoever you've got on your mind in the upcoming days and weeks. So, in saying that, kick back Aries, grab yourself a tea and coffee and chillax because this read is for you. Now, I do want to say as well, stick around to the very end, guys, because as usual, I will be drawing Animal Spirit card to just draw in some extra messages surrounding the person that you have on your mind. Okay, so, oh, this is beautiful. I like this already. Great start, Aries. You've got the vision card coming through. Now, you know where my eyes went to with this card? See these two L's? I'm seeing this as a pair, as a couple. Okay, this is a union. This is your soulmate. So I do feel as a couple, um, you and this person share... A mutual vision or there's a coming together there's like a coming together or this union taking place in the upcoming week because you both have the same outlook okay you both have the same vision maybe that vision looks like marriage maybe that vision looks like let's build a business together let's go into partnership together maybe that vision is let's start a family or let's go on a holiday so I, sh I i see a shared vision okay this is about a shared vision in the upcoming week so the cards that are coming through for you you've got the tower you've got the chariot in reverse the ace of wands the ten of wands in reverse the full and the three of cups okay so the signs of the person that you could be dealing with here with the chariot could be a cancerian that you're dealing with with the full it could be another aries uh i was going to say with the ace of wands a fire sign um aries leo sagittarius okay but if not that's okay um it could just be that the person that you're dealing with is just embodying those characteristic traits of these archetypes so what have we got here we've got we've got expect the unexpected okay expect the unexpected this week because i do feel this vision um that is going to happen uh, it's like you're coming into this vision and i feel like that's what you don't expect in the upcoming week Okay, and I feel like this is bringing a sense of joy um, within this relationship, and it's also creating a union as such because this is a reunion. So, if you and your person have been um, maybe not seeing eye to eye, maybe you've been disgruntled, or whatever it is, because the tower is here, so I do see you know maybe something has shaken you or your person up i do feel like there's this mutual coming together to reunite you as a couple okay and i feel like there is a celebration taking place absolutely okay this is joy this is happiness this is let's make a toast to this i'm really excited i can't wait major major changes are in are unfolding here and i feel like it's for the better 
you've got the ace of wands and the full heart full hard full hardy um ace of wands and the full card here which both strongly speak to new beginnings guys you know we, we you're we're in aries season oh by the way Happy birthday, Aries. <laughs> so if you're celebrating a birthday, let me know, okay? Um, you know, we're in Aries season. Aries kicks off the zodiac the, the next 12 months. And this is all about those new seeds, which we can see here with the Ace of Wands. This is like, this is a really fertile time for your relationship, for this connection, okay? This is really a highly excitable week. This is like come into the week and make the most of it because it's a highly charged week. It's a highly exciting time. Um, I see a lot of passion coming through with this Ace of Wands and a, a lot of new beginnings. And most importantly, a great opportunity. So if you are, for example, looking to start a new family, there it is. There's the Ace of Wands, okay? This is the, this is the fertile card. This is like, mate, <laughs> I'm raring to go and I'm feeling frisky and fertile. Let's do this. <laughs> Right, I, I get the sense that with this card, you will definitely, most certainly fall pregnant um, if that's the shared vision. Okay, Ace of Wands can also speak to creativity, creative sparks, feeling inspired. This is visionary, guys. This is the vision right here. This is coming in with the vision. And that might be you. You might be the initiator. You might be coming to your partner and saying, hey, I was thinking about this. What do you think? Let's do it. I feel like you're going to throw all caution to the wind and you're going to take a risk. You're going to take a chance and you're just going to do this. I do feel like with the cherry in reverse, your partner may put on the brakes with this. Okay, I feel like they might be the one that's a little unsure or a little uncertain. But I do feel like you will persuade them. Okay, I feel like you will persuade them. You will bring them around to seeing it your way. I like the, I like the energy that's coming through, Aries. I really, really do. I feel with um, this Ace of Wands and uh, just below the Ace of Wands is the Ten of Wands in reverse. I feel like you will make this partnership, this connection, this shared vision the priority. It's like I'm going to drop everything else right now. It doesn't matter. My person matters. Our vision matters. And it's like everything else falls away. Okay, everything else falls away. And I'm also seeing here too, um, I'm also seeing Aries like, what am I hearing here? I'm hearing you're going to take responsibility you're going to be the one that takes responsibility here and steer this where it needs to go i really really do for a lot of you this is about children okay or creative spark something creative there's something that you and this person are creatively planning um, new ideas are coming in because I'm essentially seeing in this card this looks like an egg okay so you and your person will be birthing something here and it's a shared goal it's a shared interest it's a shared vision it's not like one of you one of you may come up with the idea and I feel like Aries that might be you 
but your partner will come to the party with this okay they will come to the party with this i just see them a little bit hesitant at the start because they're not like you um you're more you're more over the person to kind of like let's do this because you your your excitement and your enthusiasm sort of escapes you so let's just get some more energy around your person shall we um But I feel like this is something to feel happy about, okay? Whatever's being felt here, it's it feels happy, there's joy, there's laughter. Um, your partner supports you. Your person supports you. Um, reunions, unions, you name it. It's a really good time. I like it. Okay, so the cards are a little bit quiet, so I'll take the top one. Oh, beautiful. Look at this firefly. Yes. I love this. The upward pointing triangle with the line through it does represent air. So you could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, so your person may be an air sign. Um, they're up in their head about this. And with the firefly, what do we know of the firefly? The light that comes from the firefly, it, it, it's not turned on the whole time. It sort of comes in and on, on and off, on and off. But there's a consistency with it, right? So I feel like your person is very much in their head about this, which is why there is this initial resistance coming through with them. Maybe it's just a little bit caution. Let's just slow it down, Aries, they say. Let's slow it down. Let me kind of just catch up to the idea of this, you know, this vision that you have. But I feel like they, they need to warm up to the idea. They need to warm up to it. And once they can fully grasp it the way you do, I feel like they will run with it. Okay, they will run with it. So there we have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this reading. I really enjoyed this. Um, until next time, take care.